What sign should you avoid when dating men? The negative bank account sign, the minus sign. We wanna know, men, where do you guys hang out? Where do you go? Yes, so I absolutely believe that all of the girlies should get rosters going for Hot Girl Summer. So what I personally do, historically, I do not save men's contact information. I always just have like numbers on my phone. But to make this easier, I have started, if I like go on a date slash like maybe hook up with someone, um, I will save their full name as a contact. And then in the company line, I write rotation and then a number. So like the first guy that I went out with after I broke up with my boyfriend was rotation one. And then if I got with someone else that I like better, then I demote the first guy to like rotation two. Bruh. Um, say if the new guy is rotation one, and if I am bored, I can just type rotation into my contacts and it pulls up a list of guys that I can text and um, hasn't let me down yet. She belongs to the streets. She's basically teaching women how to be three or fours. And you know what's funny about this? She's going to be the same one, let's say 10 years from now, who's going to be saying that men at ish, where did all the good men go? Yeah, where are all the men, like the good, real men at? Where are you guys? I men ain't shit. Never in my life, and I've, I, you can ask my friends, I've hooked up with a lot of people, and I've dated a lot of people. She belongs to the streets. Which makes it increasingly harder to find someone because my standards are so high. Yeah, I think it's harder to find someone because guys don't want to take her seriously anymore. Not a single person in my life has ever said, I'm interested in you. Guys don't say that. They just show it. They might say, I really like you, but they don't, in the beginning when you're dating them, they're not like, I'm really interested in you and getting to know you more. Bullshit. No! So if he said that, ew. It all depends on the guy. And what's wrong with a guy saying that, though? If he didn't say that, but he basically insinuated verbally that he's interested in you, but he isn't showing you through action and plans, then move on. Because there's three other guys in your roster, right? This wouldn't bother you if you're dating three people at a time. She belongs to the streets. Because when he's not giving you attention, someone else is. A few moments later. You need one date to get another date. You're either dating zero people at a time or like four. Not two, not three, not four, not five. Yeah. There's four people in the orbit that I'm like talking to or DMing or, you know, seeing. Get on dates. Just They're go. And by the way, don't let the ring fool you. Boss lady's not a wife. Three days later. This is why I don't do dating apps. I had just got out of a three year relationship and you know what they say, the best way to get over someone is to get under someone. That's not always the right way to do it though. I downloaded Hinge, I got to swiping and I matched with a cutie. We started talking and we finally set a date to meet. I decided to, that I was going to drive to him and let me just say, I am so glad I decided to do that. I finally made it and the second he opened my car door, I knew I fucked up. One, he lied about his height. I'm sorry, short kings are not my type. Bruh. She got turned off as soon as she found out that he was not over six feet. I mean, she got dried in the desert. Two, whatever cologne he was wearing, he literally showered in it. Three, he hopped in my car and proceeded to ask me where I wanted to go eat. Sir, you had all day to figure out where we were going to go eat. And also, why am I driving? You should be the one driving. Ended up at a goddamn like food court type of place. The guy had no shot, but you still got to take charge. You still got to take the lead as a man. Once we got our food, we decided to take it back to his place. Horrible idea. All he could talk about was money. He finally got at the idea that he wasn't going to be getting any dessert and finally walked me out. Well, I'm out, man. Women are constantly fixing men all the time. That's our favorite pastime. I can't believe it! You <laughs>